Where's a good place to eat on the island? Stay at Wind Duck Inn. Very nice. Thank you. Okay. That's some old Big Daddy told you that. Leaving the posh confines of St. Michael's, cross the drawbridge to Tillman Island and look for the country store on the left. Turn down Gibson Town Road and you'll see a shy sign on the right that identifies the Chesapeake Wood Duck Inn. You have arrived in another world with the slow, serene lifestyle enjoyed by the residents of this remote Eastern Shore fishing village. Inside the charming Victorian style inn, expect a warm welcome from hosts Kimberly and Jeffrey Bushy, who have restored the 1890 structure to an intimate hostelry with six guest rooms and a small cottage overlooking scenic Dogwood Harbor. Their modest but thoughtfully decorated inn has attracted accolades from afar, ranging from the New York Times and Good Morning America to AAA and Mobile. This historic home was originally built in 1890 as a boarding house during the heyday of the steamboats of Maryland's Eastern Shore. It has been meticulously restored and uniquely decorated and designed for your comfort with fine antiques, original art by Maureen Bannon, and classic treasures that evoke warmth and charm. Each morning, breakfast is an event to be savored, delicious, artfully prepared, and graciously presented. As quoted from Karen Brown's charming inns and itineraries in the Mid-Atlantic, the breakfast menu is as fine as any I have ever seen. A four-course dinner is also offered to inn guests on Saturday evenings for an additional fare. We are happy with our style of food, typically American, with influences from Europe and Asia. As we continue to perfect our cuisine, we place enormous emphasis on acquiring the best ingredients for our recipes. Whether it happens to be fresh local farm produce, American game, seafood, or just a local catch, we bring you flavors and presentations that far exceed your expectations. Tillman Island became, and remains, a popular haven for vacationers who were drawn by superb fishing and genteel accommodations. Paddling or sailing are just two ways to get out on the water. There are also fishing excursions, skipjack tours, sailboat tours, golf, and tennis. If you prefer to stay dry, bicycle around the scenic island, take a stroll, or just sit and read a book. No matter what you choose, the Wood Duck Inn is a welcome place to come home to. Evenings here are peaceful. There's a gentle breeze. One can watch boaters come back from their day at work, or watch the shadows of the shade trees move across the lawn. You know, it's almost time for one of our spectacular sunsets. I'm always amazed by the fact that our guests don't know each other when they check in, but are exchanging email addresses and telephone numbers when they leave, promising to return again next year. There is also that feeling one gets when one combines exceptional food with a comfortable environment. As one of our guests recently stated, this is like a great restaurant that lets you sleep over. Enjoy your stay with us, Kimberly and Jeffrey.